everyone it's Christy welcome back we are here with Roxy's weekly challenge number 19 and these are neutral or not so neutral but I'm going with neutral scrap clusters um, I may or may not finish a couple but I'm gonna put them in my cluster book so um, I have these scraps from the last uh, challenge and I'm just gonna kind of tack them down um, not going to ink them. I'm just going to see how many I can get in here. I've got some vellum. I'm not worried about them being any particular size. These will be for adding to uh, tags and such. Um, like that. And let's see tags or journal cards, whatever. So let's see that and we'll do this. There we go. Now we're going to take some of these other things that are in this bin and add them. I'm looking for variation in color. So um, take this. I'm not worried about them being glued down really well. I just want them to stick. And um, let's see what else I've got in here. I've also got some little cutoffs from other projects. These are quite thick. So I'm not sure that I want to, yeah, quite thick. I don't, I don't know if I want to use those or not. Maybe. But uh, here's a, uh, this is a sticker, so you can tear that, and this was a pretty good sticker. I'm going to cover that a little bit, and I'm not going to use it on more than two. That way... Um, we can mix it up a little bit. I think I'll stick this one down here. I'm, I don't, not really worried about it sticking to the paper because I can probably tear or cut around it. But, um, I think I've used, this has glue on the back, so it was on something else that probably fell off of. Okay. What's that? I don't, I think this might have been a cover of some sort. And I just cut it up for collage fodder. Okay, here's a piece. Um, I'm not going to worry about inking them because the whole point of this is to get it done quickly. And paper. Yeah, I don't want to use it again. And I don't want to use that again. I just want to keep, and I, I do have this piece of a digital. Whoops. <laughs> Gummied me up. Okay. What have I got over here? Uh, not really fond of beetles. Uh, there's a lot of stuff in here I'll probably uh, need to go through because I will um, most likely never use it. Yeah, lots of advertisements and, well, kitchen. Okay. So. Probably won't use that one. Probably should have used that one though. Maybe I will. I'll switch. Um, because I will tear this one and use a piece here and a piece here.
I'm not making them as large as Rachel made hers. She she made them uh, maybe three by four so that they, they would cover a whole tag. I'm not making mine that large, but I think this will work as a focal point and then this one's done. Um, what's I got in here? I'm going to skip over all those and pull out these stickers. Um, I like this one. It's a Christmassy, Christmassy one. Just bigger than that. There we go. Those are really sticky. Um, that covers up the whole flower, so I don't want that. Maybe I'll take that piece off and use it at the top. kind of want something coming down the side there. Maybe I could just take this little piece off. Yep. There we go. Kind of the same color, but that's okay. All right, I don't want any more of this vellum, but I think I'm gonna use some of these little stickers to put on these. So I've got this camera that might go there. I've got this snail, I do like a snail. He'll hang off with his little uh, antlers. Didn't, let's see, that one could go there. I need, I was thinking about this one for this. And what else? The smiley face. I kind of like this one better. And I don't think my snail, the more I look at him, the more I don't think he fits there. So maybe I'll put the clock here. Yeah. The snail could go on this one. And that might work. All right, and then if I wanted, uh, I might, if I was gonna use these, pull them off and then maybe put a piece of lace behind them since I didn't add any lace or fabric at this time. So let's, um, let's ink this up a little bit. Just don't want him to be so stark. Yeah, that's much better. But these are so sticky that I don't feel like I need to add any um, any glue. There we go. I do like these books. I think I'm going to put this toward the bottom a little bit so that you can see more of that previous, which I didn't ink. I hope that doesn't keep the sticker from sticking. Guess we'll find out. Okay. Yeah. Let's just do it like that. Same with the clock. Try to put the clocks with the 12 at the top, if I can remember. So guys, when I come back from my cruise, um, I will be starting my Princess Bride journal. And I am so excited about that. Probably should have done a little bit more fussy cut on her, but you know what? That's okay. 
I don't mind the outline if it's a little less stark. So, yeah. And there's flowers behind her, so it's kind of a feminine artwork. And then uh, when I get some tags and uh, journal cards and things that I need background or I need a quick um, decoration, I can go to my clusters and it'll be all good. All right, so there we have it. Oh, that goes over here. Um, these are my scrap clusters. And this is Roxy's Weekly Challenge number 19. I can't believe we're already on week 19 um, of this year. That's crazy. Anyway, I hope you guys have a fabulous week, weekend, day, evening, whatever it is you're having. And I'll see you next time. Bye now.